mitigate the Keros elements. We can mitigate all of the other raft of welfare cuts coming from Westminster. But until we have all of the economic and social powers in our hands, we will never be able to eradicate the scandal of child poverty in a country as rich as Scotland. We, we as part of the independence movement, we have to say loud and clear, we're fed up with the elastoplasts. We're fed up covering up for the inadequacies of the Westminster government. What we want to do is to set about building a new, a better, a fairer, and a nuclear-free independent Scotland. That's what we want. And that's why I'll finish, brothers and sisters, by making an appeal. The SNP is not the independence movement, we know that. But the SNP is the political leadership. The political leadership. That's why socialists like me, when it's come to general elections, I think it's important that socialists, when you've only got the one vote, that you use it properly that you unite behind the biggest, most progressive independence force standing in those elections. That's why in 2015, that's why in 2017, people like me argued that socialists should stand aside and support the SNP to unite the Yes campaign. to do because the SNP doesn't just stand for independence they stand for unilateral nuclear disarmament yes. they stand for holding out hell, yeah. the hand of friendship not the fist of fury to asylum seekers across the world who want to come they stand for a publicly owned, publicly controlled national health service yes! that can never be touched, yes! never be privatised. Yes! For all of those progressive reasons, it is rank stupidity of the Labour Party in Westminster to say that the SNP is not a progressive force. On yourself, Tommy. They are a left of centre progressive force. And when you've only got one vote, as a socialist, I think you should use it properly and unite behind the Independence Party yeah! in general elections. This is my appeal, my appeal to the SNP. We've given you support. You've done well in Holyrood. You've managed things as good as you could, given the limitations. But please, now the moment is coming. You asked in 2016 for a mandate, and we gave you you asked in 2017 in the Parliament for a mandate, and you won it. Brothers and sisters, if you've got a mandate, and you've got a mess as far as Westminster's concerned, yep. my appeal to the SNP is you've got the mandate. Use the mandate. In 2013, 
Let's 